That's the end of these games. I want to do one more game with you just about presents, which is this. I'm going to be, you might know a version of this game, but just let me tell you my version. So I'm in the center of the circle and I don't want to be. I want to be where you are, okay? And uh, the way that would happen is if you moved, I would try to take your place. You know this one too? Uh, <laughs> so the way that would happen is your responsibility is to move, and here's how. Your job is to uh, make connection to somebody in the circle silently, non-verbally, make a connection, eye contact, and an agreement that you're gonna switch places. I would call that a consensus. There's a consensus that you would be switching places. And then the third step is you're gonna switch places. I just wanna say those steps one more time because they're very important. <laughs> eye contact, agreement, move. And my job in the center is I'm looking for any possibility to take your place. That's all you need to do. So no words.
Tell me, just I'm curious, what does this game have to do with being a performer? Do you think? Making connections. Say? Making connections. Making connections. Communication. Communication. Reacting. Reacting. By the way, communication without language. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If you said reacting. reacting time, what else do you have to do? Instinct. What do you mean by that? It's some level of instinct, like, don't go right now when the person starts looking at you. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like survival instinct. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Knowing when to do what. Almost. Great. Great. Yeah. Yeah. To trust your your move part. Like yeah. There is a sense. I mean, and you have to get a, that has to get established pretty quickly. too. there is trust. And, I, and along that line, you can't play this game alone. You couldn't be in this game alone. Right. So there is a there's a level of trust that that is required. And also what I think is interesting is the idea of risk, of just 